With every bite of perfect seafood and sip of craft beer, you're whisked away to a flavor-filled paradise where you can soak in the tastes of the season. That's the experience you'll have at Iron Hill Brewery and Restaurant, and we are happy to welcome Brendan Mullen. He is a corporate executive chef. Welcome back. Thank you. Good to for see you. Thank you. We have got a lot here, wow. and I'm very happy, may I say. <laughs> yeah. So what are we making today? Uh, we're making our seared scallop dish that's featured on our Summer of Seafood promotion that, mm. we're, that we're currently running through August. Yeah, yeah, yeah. okay. Yeah. And you have some other dishes here, and we're gonna talk about them uh, as well. But what do we need to do to get started? Yeah. Well, let's get started on the orzo for okay. uh, the seared scallop dish. Okay. So we're going to make a, a risotto style orzo with a little bit of uh, fresh corn. Mm. Fresh some, makes all the difference. Some bacon, it? absolutely. Mm -hmm. And then we're going to add in a little bit of spinach. Okay. Which I have learned really cooks down a whole lot. It mm -hmm. does, yep, that looks like a lot, but that's going to cook down with our orzo. Mm -hmm. And now we have the orzo pasta. How's the summer season starting so far? It's going great. We've yeah. had great weather. Um, we have all these summer beers that I brought for you guys to try. Ooh. Um, so the season has kicked off really well for us. Okay. And what was and what is and that? So that's a Chardonnay cream sauce. Oh, that sounds amazing. I <laughs> thought it was mayonnaise, but. <laughs> <laughs> so we're going to cook this down, and while that's cooking, we're going to get started on searing our scallops. Okay. okay. Uh, so over here. I have some uh, some beautiful sea scallops. They are beautiful. We're gonna put a little bit of butter down. Okay. Thank you. And then we're gonna get a good sear on these. Mm. Is it hard to get a good sear? Uh, you need to have a really hot pan and you need to have a little bit of patience. So it's not hard to do, but first thing people wanna do is shake the pan right. and get it moving around, Don't all that, that action. But what you wanna do is you wanna let it sear, caramelize, and get that really great flavor. Ah, okay. Ah. So if I mess it up, I can eat one and just put another one in. <laughs> sure. I'm just yeah. trying to make sure, okay. That works. <laughs> make sure I understand so for the those, rules here. For folks who haven't visited you yet, where are you located? Um, well, we're located at Rehoboth Beach, mm -hmm. Wilmington, Delaware, and Newark, around mm -hmm. here in the Delmarva area. Um, but we have 20 locations now. Uh, we're opening up our 21st um, in July in Lehigh Valley. Wow. So we're wow. all the way down in Atlanta, Georgia, um, over Hershey, Lancaster area. And uh, next month we'll be in Lehigh Valley. That's amazing. So as corporate executive chef, you get to travel to all, all over, right? All of I travel all over the place. Oh yeah, it's really my exciting. goodness! And eat all the amazing food. Yep. Okay. So how long is this is this going to take? Uh, these are just going to take a couple minutes to cook. So we're going to flip these now, mm -hmm. and we got our nice caramelized sear on there. Oh my goodness! <laughs> Again, we're going to tell you, gosh. We wish you could smell this. <laughs> <laughs> and then we're going to pair this with one of our uh, summer beers that we have, uh, Lemon Cerveza. It's a Mexican style lager. Um, really crisp and refreshing, uh, brewed with a little bit of lemon. That's going to go great with this um, scallop fish. Oh, okay. It's with interesting how you pair, pair the beers with the food. I would not know how to do that. Uh, yeah, we're always, um, we're always trying to taste the beer and, and be inspired for the food and vice versa, the, the brewers are, are uh, inspired by the food to brew new beer. Mm -hmm. um, this dish right here is our linguine with clams and we actually made a broth um, that has our lemon cerveza in it. So we're cooking with the beer uh, wow. in this instance. Okay, and beside that, that looks amazing. What do you got there? Yes, this is one of the appetizers we're featuring. It's a tuna tartare. It has a sesame soy vinaigrette, so a little Asian uh, flavor, uh, a little sriracha, fresh avocado, edamame and a pineapple salsa, and that's with a wonton crisp. And that's an appetizer? That's an appetizer. <laughs> oh. I can eat that for a meal. No. And then over here, this looks like a, a seafood uh, broil or yes, broil. Yes, this is the star of the show. This is a chipino, which is a seafood stew. Uh -huh. It's tomato based, it has fennel broth, um, but it has a ton of fresh seafood in there. So we have snow crab, calamari, little neck clams, mussels, cod, shrimp, and scallops. So with something like that, what beer would you pair with it with all those different seafoods? Um, this goes well with an IPA. Mm -hmm. um, our uh, Autoplay IPA is, is paired really well with this. Mm -hmm. um, and also I brought another beer along, Seedless, which is a watermelon sour, which is really refreshing and great for summer. Interesting. Watermelon sour. 
Got to try that. All right, so we're going to take a little break here, and when we come back, we're going to plate this up and try it. Yep, we're going to plate up the scallops. All right, sounds great. Stick around, Del Marva Life. We'll be right back. The seafood feast in the Del Marva Life kitchen today, rich with color, flavor, and texture. And yes, our sea scallops have been seared. We are back <laughs> in the Del Marva Life kitchen with corporate executive chef Brendan Mullen with Iron Hill Brewery and Restaurant. Thank you so much yeah. for everything that yeah, you're doing and have me. done here. So, where, at what point are you now? Where are you? What, what are you uh, so, we have our orzo cooked, um, our scallops have been seared, okay. and we're ready to plate it up. Okay. Let's do um, it. So, we have our roasted red pepper coulis that we're going to put down on the plate right there. <laughs> um, and then I'm going to put a little bit of our risotto style orzo right in the middle. Mm. This has fresh corn, bacon, and spinach. Bacon and scallops is a, a real treat to pay, have paired together. <laughs> and the colors just pop. And now we have our seared sea scallops. And then we're gonna garnish this with a little bit of chive oil. Chive oil? Gives it a little bit of color and a pop of flavor and some fresh chives. Fresh chives. And that's the dish. That looks amazing. Thank you. Almost too pretty to eat. But we'll get almost. over that. Almost. Yeah, almost. <laughs> <laughs> almost is as far as that statement goes. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you again. Tell us again where we can find you here on Delmarva. Um, so you can visit our website, ironhillbrewery.com. Um, it'll it'll show you where which location is closest to you. Right. Uh, we're down near Rehoboth Beach, um, right on the riverfront in Wilmington, um, and in downtown Newark, Delaware. Aha! Uh -huh. That's a really big bite. Think I can handle that? You got that. You got that. <laughs> I know you do. Mmm. Mmm. <laughs> and see, the worst part about it is we can't tell you how good it is while we're eating. Mmm. <laughs> That is great. Now, what beer goes with that? Our lemon cerveza. The um, lemon cerveza. Yeah, we have one right there. It's a really great pairing. Mm. Lisa, if you like. Oh, you're gonna. I'm gonna taste it. Mm, okay. Yeah. Because I'm going back after this. Oh, okay. Oh, I see what you do. Yeah. You get busy with the beer, <laughs> yeah. and then you. Let me see how it goes with the flavors. <laughs> oh, that's good. Oh, that's really good. Oh, thank you. Yeah, that is great. And of course, um, you have the new seafood menu all summer. We do. We're featuring this menu until August 20th, so okay. um, through, through the bulk of the summer. That's amazing. And then if anybody needs any help d with the pairings, you're you'll there to help them? I mean, you, the yeah, staff we have, can help. we have brewers on site, um, mm -hmm. the chefs are on site, and also our servers are very knowledgeable on beer. Um, we craft our menus with suggested pairings. Um, and we also have a pairing guide in the back of our core menu mm. um, that lets you know which, which kind of food um, goes with which style of beer. Um, but really, there's no wrong answer. You pick something that you like and you try to match it together. Um, and it's a really great experience to have at Iron Herbal Brewery. Brewery. Okay. And if it's not perfect, try it again. Yep. There you go. <laughs> As you can tell, we don't like it. I was, I was going to tell you, I've double dipped into this, so I don't think I, you want to eat anymore. I think I've triple dipped really? into oh, it. Well, there we go. <laughs> well, Brendan, thank you so much for coming in thank and bringing all me. this amazing food and, of course, the beer that goes with it. You need to check it out. Iron Hill. Stick around. Del Marva Life. We'll be right back.